Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for watching. So today I have for you these really glamorous and beautiful and sexy smoky eyes. I have a beautiful shade of red lipstick as well. I hope that you enjoy this makeup look. It is so easy to do and I'm gonna show you how. So if you wanna see how I got this makeup look, stay tuned and let's get started. I already did my skin in the previous two videos that I have in my channel so I'm gonna skip this skin today. To make this video a little faster and easier so i'm gonna move on to my eyes already but if you need i'm gonna put the link down below for my brow routine and for my skin as well so move on to my eyes the first thing i'm gonna do is apply the eyeshadow primer this is the shadow insurance primer by Too faced and i really love it because it lasts super super long and on top of it i'm gonna apply a nude eyeshadow you can use any eyeshadow that it works for your skin shade i'm using the shade heart shaped cookie by sugar peel i'm I'm applying the eyeshadows using the Zoeva brushes today. This is from the Rose Gold Deluxe Edition. So I decided to apply a bronzer by Too Faced as well. And this is a color Medium Deep from the Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. A little warm brown shade to create a depth and dimension in my eyes. I love this product to use as a shadow as well because the formula is so thin. So the powders blend so well on the skin. And this is the same bronzer that I already used in my face. So to make it easier, I'm gonna use it in my eyes as well. And now I'm gonna use a highlighting shade in my tear duct area. I'm applying this eyeshadow with this little tiny brush, also by Zoeva. And the eyeshadow that I'm gonna use is one of my favorite eyeshadows to highlight. This is Nylon by MAC. So I'm gonna apply this eyeshadow in the tear duct area and a little bit in the brow bone to create even more dimension in my eyes. Next, I'm gonna just line my eyes using the gel liner Wicked by Sigma. Yes, again, I love this gel liner. I'm gonna just just a little little eyeliner and then i'm gonna apply this gel liner in the waterline and a little bit in the lower lash line as well i'm using a really precise angled brush for this and i love to use gel liner because it lasts longer for me And now to smoke it out to the lower lash line, I'm gonna apply a black eyeshadow in this blackout by Motivis Cosmetics. This is one of the blackest eyeshadows that I ever used. And I'm gonna apply this eyeshadow a little at a time using this really tiny brush. This one is from Sigma. You can use my code MelissaSB for 10% off in sigmabeauty.com in case you're interested to get anything from Sigma. And now in my lid, I'm gonna apply one of the best glitter glue ever that I love so much and I have been using this glue for many years. This is the glitter glue from Too Faced. And I'm gonna apply this product all over my lid using my clean finger. What I love about this glue is that it never ruined my smoky eyes. As you can see, it stay on in the right place. And now on top of it, using a fluffy brush, I'm gonna apply the glitter. This is the Reflect Gold by MAC. I love this glitter because it's so thin and amazing. As you can see, so beautiful. I love it so much. It's one of the best glitters. I'm gonna apply this glitter all over this glue. And then of course, I'm gonna back again with the angled brush that I was doing my eyeliner and fix all this little mess that I did. Of course you can do your eyeliner after but I'm gonna tell you a little secret. I prefer to start the eyeliner and then I apply the glitter and next I apply the eyeliner again. You can use a liquid eyeliner using glitter but I prefer to use the gel one always. And now I'm gonna apply the fake lashes. I'm using style Scarlet by Huda Beauty. I like to feel my eyes like a butterfly as you can see i just remember how fluffy and long they are oh my god so next to finish off my face i'm gonna apply blush and this is oh this is a beautiful color hudson touch by the balm i love this shade and it's so pigmented and now i'm gonna apply this diamond gorgeous highlighter oh my god look at this this is so 
cute and the effect in this skin is amazing oh my god they look so beautiful and blend so well in this skin i really love it i'm using the highlighter love light by Too faced and the shade that i'm using is blinded by the lights using the foam strobing brush by sigma it's just so pretty as the name and now for my lips, I'm using some special products that I'm gonna show you. This is a really great brand that I just discovered. The first thing that I'm gonna apply to exfoliate my lips, I want my lips to stay beautiful and juicy. So I'm gonna use the Volcanic Lip Scrub and massage it to my lips a little bit for a few seconds and remove all the dead skin. This will help to make my lips ready for a liquid lipstick. This lip scrub is amazing, but it's not yet the key of this amazing and perfect plump lips. And next, I'm gonna apply the Volumizing Lip Plumper by Plump It. This product is great. I thought it could be just a little moisturizer, but when I apply it in my lips, oh my god, it's kind of burn a little bit in the beginning. It's like a pepper filling the lips, but when I saw the result, it was wow, so cute. So I apply this product for a few minutes and let my lips soak all the moisture, and it's a really great product. And next, I'm gonna apply a little bit of the moisturizing lip balm. I love this formula because I can apply any liquid lipstick or lipstick on top of it. It looks great in my lips, works beautifully as you can see. Now I'm gonna apply the lip liner by Huda Beauty. I'm using the shade Famous. I love this lip liner because I cannot remove it from my lips. Just if I remove with a makeup remover. I love how it lasts longer and how it stays on my lips. And next I'm gonna apply the liquid lipstick by The Balm. I'm using the shade Adoring. And this shade is so pretty. It's a deep red shade, more of wine shade. It's so amazing and works for everybody. Oh my god, I love this color so much. And I hope that you enjoy it as well. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you still didn't and follow me on Instagram to see more pictures of my work. Also hit the notification bell twice to make sure that you're gonna receive all the new videos that I post here. Thank you for being here with me. I really hope that you enjoyed this makeup look. Give a thumbs up if you did. And I will see you in the next tutorials. Bye!